One word is amazing. One word, pleasurable. Exciting. Fun. It's a connection. Dancing to me is like swimming in the air. this old couple like doing the fox trot on, on the cruise ship dance floor and they're just like this cute old couple and then we kind of want to be that cute old couple. Well, when you walk in the first time it was like have, I had no idea what I'm getting into. We saw people putting shoes on and there was a couple dancing and we were like they looked oh, good. Boy. And they looked good and we're like oh. And then we had our first introductory lesson and it was just a lot of fun. You know, they, they played some great music, we did what we knew how to do, which was very little back then, and it was just a good time. We started with an initial group of 10 lessons, and at the end of, uh, of the series of lessons, we were ready for more. <laughs> well, I see all these performances, and all the competitions, and all the clothes that we have to wear, we can compete. I like it. My favorite dance styles typically are rhythm. I personally like foxtrot a lot. I like rumba and tango. My very favorite dance is the rumba. Rumba is like a sensual dance. It's, it's in place. It's not a traveling dance, so it's not smooth. It's a little bit slower. As, as you can tell, I'm a bit older. You can articulate the moves and really polish them and make it look good. You know, it has a lot of intricacy to it, where you compare that to say something like a waltz or a foxtrot, which themselves can also get quite intricate, but they're more about traveling and moving along the floor. The waltz is really great because it's really graceful and you're poised and you get to really travel around the floor. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. It reminds me of like one. the old style, like Graham Hall rooms with the princesses. It's like kind of waltz takes you somewhere else. Waltz, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. Three, the waltz is like floating around the floor. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like waltz transforms you to a whole different place. Tango is uh, more like uh, two lovers dance together and then they, you know, they have eternal love and passion for each other. It's supposed to be like very sharp and uh, very like pointed and almost like excited, you know, like there's, a, there's an energy, like an excitement to it. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely see a change in my students. Um, from when they begin and from when they just continuously come. Most people come in here um, saying they want to learn to dance, but they want something else out of it. Whether it's like, I want to connect with people, or I want confidence, or I just, I'm tired of standing at the bar the whole time at the party. Like, there's always something else. So, we usually try to figure that out. We know you're here to dance, but what do you really want? And then that's kind of how we tailor our classes and our personal lessons so that people get what they're really underlying trying to get. And you see people blossom. Like there's people who come in here slouched and shy and they don't want to talk. And then now they're like running around like, hey, what's up? Dance with me. Da 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 da. You're doing something this weekend. Like, it's a 360 change. There's people who come in here and like their whole, how they look changes. They start dressing differently. They start acting different. There's people who come here and found love. Like, it's really miraculous how many people have changed just from coming to dance class. <laughs> like, it's not just dance class. It's a lot more.